For this video, we're going to be looking at a few interesting things when it comes to work, making use of Excel. So we're going to be looking at how to generate a new workbook, how to add worksheets, copy and move worksheets, modify the worksheet orders, as well as hiding and changing the worksheet tabs. The easiest way to create a new workbook is obviously opening up Excel from your desktop, or if you want, you can go to File, New, and then you can either select your blank workbook workbook or you can select various templates that are given to you on Microsoft Excel. The other way of creating a new workbook is by pressing the control and N key. So now that you know how to create a new workbook, let's learn or well, let's look at how to create new worksheets within our current workbook. If we come down to the very bottom here we can see that we have sheet one. If we go to this plus sign we can add a new sheet and we can go for infinite amount of sheets. As we start moving across and start adding more and more worksheets, you can now see that these arrows become available. So you can move across to our current worksheet or we can move to the very first one. Okay, so that is how you create new worksheets within your workbook. Now, to move your worksheets around, you can do it in one of two ways. You can select the worksheet with your left mouse button, click and hold it. Now you can see that there is a black arrow that is appearing at the front of sheet 2. As I start moving it around, where that arrow is, okay, that is where the worksheet will be slotted into. So we can move it, and let's move uh, sheet 2 between 5 and 6. So there's the arrow between 5 and 6, I let go. That is where it has been placed. The other way of moving it is if we right click, click on the move or copy button, and we can select where we want to go. So if we wanted to go back in between sheet 1 and 3, I'll select sheet 3 saying that is where we are going to place it, it must go above that. Click OK and it has been moved back. The other way or the other thing we're going to be looking at is how to copy it. So under the right click move and copy option, we can select the sheet we want and we go create a copy and we select OK. So now you see it's created a second sheet too and in brackets has called it number two. So we've looked at moving and modifying our worksheet orders. The other thing we're gonna be looking at is how to hide worksheets and how to change the tab colors. So to change a tab color, we select a worksheet we want, and over here where it says tab color, we move our mouse over that, and we can choose a color we wish to look at. So let us go for that red color. There we go, so that has now been changed. One of the other things we're going to, or the last thing we're going to be looking at quickly is how to hide and unhide a worksheet. So again, we select the worksheet we want, we right click, and we go to our hide option. All right. So therefore, it's now hidden. If I want to hide multiple sheets, all I have to do is press the shift key on my keyboard, move to sheet 10 or 11, I right click, and I go hide. Okay, there we go, we've, unhid we've hidden all of those sheets. If I want to now unhide one specific one, I right click, I select the unhide option, and then I can choose the sheet that I want to unhide. So let's take sheet two. There we go. And that is how we make use of the hide and unhide options. 